What is going on ladies and gentlemen, HD Beasley back with another Modern Warfare 2 Remastered video. And uh, just before we get into this video, I want to apologise if I do sound a bit quiet. It's like really early hours in the morning and uh, my parents are sleeping right now. But I thought I'd bring you this video and actually have a discussion about it with you guys and uh, see what you guys think. So, we're all here under, this, under the assumption that Modern Warfare 2 Remastered is going to happen and uh, it will have multiplayer and that's what this video is about um, and basically the multiplayer if it's in Modern Warfare 3 Remastered which it pretty much it, it's going to be in my opinion how awesome do you guys think it's going to be now just give me a second I just I think for some reason I have colorblind turned on there you go sorry about that <laughs> Recording live gameplay and talking about a subject is uh, pretty hard if you do YouTube like myself. But anyway, back to the point. Um, Modern Warfare 2 Remastered multiplayer will be fantastic. It'll be just like the original. But there, are, there are, there's a reason why I'm making this video is, and that is taking into account noob tubes. Yeah, you know the death streaks. Um, you know the constant boosting. How are Activision going to counter that? Like. Are our new tubes gonna be back? Are the death streaks going to be back? Um, you know, you guys can let me know what you think about think about it in the comment section below. Which is which is why I'm making this video. Um, I personally think everything that was in the original will be in the remastered. And personally, I don't see them changing too much because if they were to go and change it too much to a point where it's a completely different game just like how MWR is then it's not going to be the same and people are going to be pissed and you know we don't want that we don't want people to be pissed in the COD community you know Modern Warfare 2 was just was such a successful game uh, the most successful COD in all time probably uh, multiplayer wise then you know we don't we, you know we don't have to ruin it so yes you can say new, new tubes are going to ruin the game but like you know, so did snipers, like, you know, Modern Warfare 2 was the peak of sniping and quick scoping and trick shotting and that, and, you know, it was a part of Modern Warfare 2, and so was Noob Tube, and so you take one aspect away from the game, you take one thing that was in the original away from the remaster, and it's not the same game, it really isn't, and I can understand why you guys are like, yeah, but you can't say that we can't have. You have to have new tubes. It, everyone's going to use them at launch. I get that, but it will die off, guys. You know, you know, it's, it's, as serious as people want Modern Warfare 2 Remastered to happen, they want it to happen because they want to have fun with the multiplayer. They don't want it to happen because they're going to run around, with, run around with a new tube hours upon hours all day. You know, they're going to actually be playing the game properly. That's what you guys need to understand, and I think that's what a lot of people are getting a bit worried about. Is that everyone's going to be new tubing, but you know, guys, everyone's going to be quick scoping, everyone's going to be trick shotting. It's just one of them things, it's going to happen, and we're going to have to get on with it. So, yeah, <laughs> that's my opinion on it. I, I think they should just keep it the same. I, I only personally think they'll keep it the same anyway. Why change it? Why change it? I mean, there's, 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 no, there's no real reason why to change it. Modern Warfare Master has new tubes in, they didn't take them out, so why change it? How you guys can obviously see where I'm coming from, and then. There's the second topic that I wanted to talk about, obviously, in this, for this video. Death streaks. Like, Modern Warfare 2 was the worst game for death streaks, okay? It rewarded the player for going on the bad streak, basically. And I can understand why people are angry about, you know, the death streaks being in the game. But I also think that the death streaks ought to stop in the game. Now, I know I'm probably going to get a lot of hate, and I'm probably like the first YouTuber to say this, but it, it, that that was in the game. You know, it, death streaks were implemented in the game because of how powerful the streak, the kill streaks were. Like if someone has a Harrier and a chopper gunner, you go on like a ten death streak. The game rewards you because it feels sorry for you. And um, I know it sounds a bit of a cheat way, but you know, realistically, it doesn't really help you a lot. Like there's one that gives you extra health, like painkiller or something like that. That's not that bad. There's Final Stand, which a lot of people moan about, and or Last Stand, or whatever it's called. And I don't, I've never, never understood why people moan about that. Because if you're shooting someone, and then you put them into Last Stand, surely you'd carry on shooting them 
until them until they're dead. Like I just, I, there's just a lot of things that my over three massive multiplayer shouldn't, should have and shouldn't have. But personally, I think they should just keep it the same. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below, and drop a like on this video. Or drop a like on the video anyway, because if you enjoyed listening to my voice in a really quiet manner. <laughs> but anyway, guys, this was a short video. But all for theory, master multiplayer info. Well, not information video, but it was just a multiplayer video, a recap and that. And uh, drop a like, subscribe. One away from 450. That would be absolutely fantastic if we can hit it by tomorrow. And I'll see you guys pretty soon. Peace out.